Well, now for a look at the bald Archies, paintings poking fun at Australian celebrities. Politicians and sports stars feature heavily this year. Isaac Naruzny takes us through some of the colourful and controversial entries. The bald Archies aren't about having the best artwork. Prize is given for a statement. The technicality of skill of the artist is not uppermost, which is in a lot of competitions. These pictures are designed to have an impact and aren't afraid to tackle controversial issues. Hit me in the face if you can. Most of the artwork focuses on the people who made headlines in the past 12 months. And after a big year in politics, where Australia got yet another Prime Minister, there was plenty for artists to work with. Well, this year's event is killer, killer politician year, basically. Australia's sports stars didn't get off lightly either. Last year, cricketer Cameron Bancroft was banned for his role in the ball tampering scandal. And one artist decided to get creative, using sandpaper as his canvas. The winner of the Bald Archie Prize will receive $10,000. It's the only competition in the world that's being judged by a cockatoo named Maud. That's right, a bird will decide which artist wins $10,000. And judging by some of the entries, she's got a tough task ahead of her. So don't ask me how she does it. She bobs up and down if she likes and she screams obscenities that could not possibly be on this station if it's out. A fitting judge for the event. Isaac Naruzi, ABC News, Canberra.